All right, go live, go live, go live. It hasn't said whether I am live yet or not, but uh, hello, guys. How are you doing today? Hopefully, everybody is uh, is a okay Today, we're going to be continuing on with our VTOL, as you guys can see. And, um, yeah, today we're probably going to add some lights and stuff like that to this thing. We might also come up with some containers that we can have in the back uh, that maybe can be, like, extra troop transport or, or whatever. Um, but, yeah, hi. How is everybody doing today? Hopefully, you guys are all a okay um, let me know in the comments down below, or let me know in the comments, the chat, the live chat, uh, how you guys are out of seven. Let me know. Let me know. Uh, but hi, 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 hi. Um, you're late. I'm not late. We're not late. What are you talking about? Uh, good morning from the USA. Good morning. Uh, also, this is really bright, so I'm going to lift this up. There we go. That's fine. Uh, please don't ask me if I remember you. I do, but please don't ask. Um, da -da 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 -do -do -de da 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 What do you guys think of this thing so far? Do you think it looks okay? I think it looks pretty cool, to be honest. Um, we need to make sure that it does actually run off of its own fuel. That's one of the first things we need to do. And then we need to figure out how to, um, get more fuel involved with this thing. Because it needs more fuel added to it, which is really annoying. But yeah. I like the futuristic look. Yeah, it looks cool, don't you think? Looks very cool. Wait, what is happening now? It's turning. Oh! <laughs> I was like, why is it turning? That's so weird. That's so... Yeah, okay. There's a, there's a twister. Okay, we'll just try and fly away from that. Hopefully we can. Yikes. Okay, I don't know whether we can. It looks great. Thank you. Wait, is something getting damaged? I think we can fly straight past it. There you go. Put it to the test. Yeah, it works. It's fine. It's completely fine. Nice. Uh, so yeah, we're going to add some lights to this thing today. Uh, we're going to make all of that work. And then we're going to go for for the rest. A more powerful engine? What for? What would, it, what would we need a more powerful engine for? It already lifts like four containers we've tested. It'd probably lift more if we needed it to, but that's cool. Right, anyway, we need to figure out how to get fuel into this thing. So that's the first thing we're going to do. Let's do some fuel. Hello from Wales. Hi. Uh, test it against the tornado? We did! We just flew past. We don't want to fly through it, that'll destroy our aircraft. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, that would definitely destroy our aircraft. We don't really want that. But, um, yeah, let's make sure this works before we do anything else. We're gonna make the fuel... the fuel work! Right, pipe. So we're gonna bring this down, and then we're gonna bring it inside using this. There we go. And then we're gonna put a pump directly onto there, and that is... Uh, essentially all we need. So a pump can go right here. Excellent. Out. No, we need that to go in. Hang on. There, like that. There we go. And then we need a fluid port. And now we should be able to run under our own fuel, uh, I believe. Actually, side note, maybe we could have run off our own fuel anyway. It's just this was diesel. Ah. Should we try it without the pumps? Do we need pumps? I'm not sure. Try it without and then we'll go with. And we'll see if that works. It looks spectacular. Do you guys like it? I, I like it. I think it looks pretty cool. Anyway, uh, infinite fuel off. Let's see if we can uh, allow this to work. I'm unable to watch the stream. Why? What happened? What happened? Is Estonia it's actually five? Interesting. Very interesting. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and see if the engines start with no pump. They do! Aha! So we don't even need a pump. It was already going to work uh, from what we already had. So let me load up this. Do -do 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 and uh, we go from that. Me too, I can't. Ethiopia. Oh, I read Estonia. My bad. No. Estonia is the same time. Oh, no, it's 24. You guys are 24 hours out from each other. That's wrong. Surely that's wrong. Anyway. <laughs> right. We need to just go inside of here. We need to click on this and make this jet fuel. And now we should be good to go. Yeah. I can't see your stream for some reason. Uh, can you hear me? Maybe refresh. Refresh the stream and maybe you can. Do, 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 do. Will you put it on the workshop? Uh, yeah. I will eventually. I'm not sure when, but we will eventually. I want to make the back end look a little bit nicer, because at the minute we've obviously got the horizontal stabilizer thing. But I think I want to make it a little bit longer, and then maybe add some, add some things on the edges. Because I think that'll look cool, so we'll probably end up doing that. Maybe. All right, here we go. We're going to go forwards out of here. Lift up the front landing gear. Awesome. And let's go again. Put guns. 
We might add guns in the future. Not yet, though. Um, do 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 do. Duplicate it and make it float on water. But the front end isn't actually uh, secured. Isn't actually secured. I guess we could make a version that would be, but I don't know. Anyway, there we go. Woo! Nice. Okay, yeah, no, we can make this look better. We can definitely make this look better. So, we are actually running on our own fuel this time, which is excellent. Uh, however, I don't think we'll be running on our own fuel for very long. Because <laughs> our fuel tank is actually very small. So, we need to figure that out. Anyway, let's go back, now that we are actually flying under our own fuel. We'll probably have to add our own battery and stuff like that. Uh, and we'll go with that. However, I want to build this in first. So... I want these to be wider by probably like another one of these, maybe. So I'll attach that onto there, flip it around and stuff. There we go. Excellent. Uh, we'll do that. Very nice. And then we'll attach this directly onto there, just like so. And then on the end of here, I'm going to put a pivot. Yep. Uh, and we're going to actually have this angled uh, in a few different directions. I think that'd be very cool. Time for some wedgies. Time for some wedgies. All right, here we go. So we'll attach this. Actually, no, we won't. We'll do this straight away. Um, we'll then attach this onto the top of here. Excellent. Uh, this as well. I think we'll delete this piece. We'll bring this up by at least three. And we'll put a rudder directly onto there. Here we go. So uh, do it on this side. Uh, which side? Which way around do these need to go? Open on the right. Open on the right. Like this. There we go. Excellent. And this piece too. Very nice. So I want it to angle inwards at the top. That's that's what I'm going for here. Mirror. It is mirrored. What do you mean? We've done it on both sides. What you talking about? Uh, Dominic. Hi. How are you doing? Uh, right. Okay. So let's do this. Very good. Let's delete this piece. And actually, no. We will keep that like that. That's fine. Do that right there. And do this right here. That's probably fine. I think that's okay. Uh, have I missed anything? I have no idea. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. Who knows? How long will this stream be? I'm not sure. Probably around two hours. We'll see. Hello from the Netherlands. Hi. How are you doing? I'm eating breakfast while watching your stream. What country are you in? Probably America, right? Probably America. All right. Okay. We're then going to do this on this piece uh, for the underside, which is going to do the exact same thing. I believe. So we're going to attach all of that to there. We're going to add one of these to the underside of here. Like so. Same thing on this side. There we go. And then we're going to build them in and hopefully make them look pretty. Pretty. All right, so that goes there. This goes here. And then this goes directly under there like this. Okay, so they're going to angle themselves in different directions. Hopefully that'll look good. I didn't manage to mirror that bit. That's annoying. All right, there we go. So copy this, move it to the other side, paste it back on, and we'll be good. You're from the Netherlands also. Nice. Very nice. All right, there we go. So we need to figure out how to, or where, or how. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, we need to actually angle these guys. So we're going to do this and this. This one is going to connect to the top, or to that one, and also that one. And then this one's going to connect to this one. And also this one. And we're going to see if this will work. Let's go. Whee! Okay. That looks pretty cool. It adds a little bit of extra weight, though, and that's a problem. But Oh, wow. Hang on a second. Hang on one second. We need a minus number on both of these. Otherwise, we're going to have problems. Also, what is connected to what here? That's connected to this. Oh, that's not how we want it. That is, that is not how we want it. Uh, we'll actually connect that that way instead. And then merge this with this. There we go. That makes more sense. Yeah. Merge that with that. There we go. Okay, so now it's going to work uh, a little bit better. So attach this to there. Whoa. And attach it. Whoa, I can't even see where I am now. To here as well. Uh, music. I forgot about music. Uh, Spotify. Let's go. What is the code name for your aircraft? Uh, I don't have a code name for the aircraft yet. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We'll start from the top. There we go. All right, cool. So that's all good. Let's go ahead and uh, do it again. Actually, wait, put a minus on this. So min value, minus one. Min value on this one, minus one. 
We're just trying to figure out what, what angle we want it at first before we do anything else. Yes. Yes. All right, here we go. So, yeah, that one needs to fold in by like a little bit. Let's go with 0.2. All right, and then this one on the top needs to be 0. Point, minus 0. 0.2. So minus 0. 0.2 on both sides. Let's do it. <laughs> Let's do it. Delete this. There we go. Number... Da -da 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 there we go, constant number all the way in the back. There we go, excellent. This is going to be min minus 0 0.2. We're going to attach this to both of these and also both of these, and that should be good. Yeah, okay, that works. Looks a bit weird, but it works. Nice. Uh, I'm going GL uh, with the stream. What does that mean? What does that mean? Put it above a volcano. It doesn't actually do anything, though. The, if you put it above a volcano, it, it doesn't actually change anything with the aircraft. Um, if we landed it in the in the volcano, it would change things. But it would just set me on fire. <laughs> That's all it would do. All right, there we go. Let's do that. So the top one's bigger than the bottom one. Kind of interesting. And then we need some weight. Or we need to take weight out of the back. Is there any way we can take weight out of the rear? There is. All right, okay, hang on. Delete this all the way across, uh, like this. Here we go. Do it again, and again. Hey, right, wing. Here we go. Okay, so we should be able to attach this directly under there. Bring it forwards a few. There we go. Bring it forwards a few, and there. So it should weigh less towards the back now, but we will add a little bit of extra weight in the front, just because we can. So build that in right there. Spawn it in. Does it work? Yes. No! <laughs> I can't see your stream. That's weird. I wonder why. Try refreshing. I'm not sure why you wouldn't be able to see it. Farm. Hi, Farm. How you doing? Alright. We might need to come up with a different landing gear system just for the rear. Because it being on the engines isn't really working out for us, you know? Uh, hey, just so you know, wing sections have a side which produces more lift. Yeah, I know. Someone said that the other day. Um, I'm not sure which way around it is, but at the moment, we're just using it to uh, become lighter. So, I think that's fine. Anyway, let's see if this works. Yeah, do you guys like that more than what we had? I think I do. I think that looks sick. In fact, actually, let's let's make it white again. I keep reverting back to the white color because I think it looks slick like that. I think it looks pretty cool. Uh, but I do actually like this. How is the weather? For me, it's raining. Uh, it's just overcast. That's it. It's just a bit cloudy. Do you play SnowRunner? Uh, not really. I have videos on it, but I, I don't really play it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Right, so. Uh, kind of want to add like some buttons up here. So we will. Here we go. Buttons. Here we go. Yes. In this color. Let's go. Yeah. Toggle button. Bam. Bam. So these are going to be our lights. This is going to be spotlights right in the middle. This is going to be nav lights right on the side. And then this is going to be uh, cockpit lights right there. So let's attach the nav lights together straight away. We've already got those. So right there. Right there. And one at the back. There we go. We're going to add some blinking lights as well, because I think that would be cool. Uh, spotlights on the wings. They're in there. They're in there. Excellent. And then cockpit light. We don't currently have one. Let's add some. Uh, light. Here we go. So get them in white to begin with. We'll put one here. And I guess that's fine. And then we'll put one there, I guess. Yeah, sure. That looks fine. So we got we got a few lights in here. That's fine. Cockpit lights can now be attached. There we go. One, two, and three. And then we need to paint the outside because I've accidentally ruined it. There we go. Good. All right. Let me rechat for a second. There's a wing section on the workshop that is the correct way up. Okay. Well, I'm okay for now. I'm, I'm sure it'll be fine. When will this creation be done? I have no idea. I might disconnect. Okay. Uh, you should add a hose connector for firefighting. Yeah, we might do something like that. We'll see. Hi, Frantic. Hope you're doing great. And again, greetings from Greece. Hi. Um, I'm doing okay. Hopefully you're doing okay too. 
Uh, da -da -da. How does it look in the color black? It won't look right. You mean black black? Like, I mean, I guess it works. I don't really like it though. Or if it was like fully gray. I guess that works too, but I like it in white. What if we make it slightly off gray? I just feel like it's not, not quite poppy enough, you know? You're such an underrated YouTuber. I'll see your builds are really cool. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, make some custom containers uh, for stuff like fuel, generator, cargo, passengers, etc. Yeah, that is what we were planning on doing today. Um, but we haven't quite got to it yet. We haven't quite got to it yet. All right, there we go. That looks sick. Uh, we've added the bit on the rear. Shall we make this a little bit taller? I'm not sure we should. Yikes. I don't know, because we could do this kind of thing. And then the vertical stabilizers are a little bit bigger, but it looks weird, doesn't it? I think I'll leave them low. I think I'll leave them like that. That's fine. Um, okay, we can actually fit another one of these in here, too. One, two, three. All right, whack that in there like that. Excellent. Delete this, put it in there. Very nice. Yeah, that works. Um, am I light? Not really. No. Uh, have you used the underwater base mod? Mod? What do you mean by mod? Um, da -da 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 -da. I wish you good luck at reaching 200k subs. Thank you. Uh, can you make a float mode? See, the problem with a float mode is the way we've done the doors on the front, they're not, they're not sealed. So the front end actually isn't sealed at all, uh, which is a little bit of a problem, you know? A little bit of a problem, but that's okay. Uh, right, let's spawn it in and get the lights on and see if they work. We need to add a little bit more weight in the front, which is super annoying, but there you go. In fact, let's do it now. Let's add more weight. More of this. Here we go. Whack it right there. And you shouldn't really add weight to the front of an aircraft, but hey-ho, there you go. Maybe we need to lower this down. No, okay. Because it bounces, but... Weird. Uh, firefighting tank? Yeah, we'll add a firefighting tank, probably a refueling tank of sorts. Um, maybe literally just a fuel container, that'd be cool. Maybe try 73, 70, 65 for the color. Well, I'll, uh, I'll do that in a second, and we'll see what it looks like. Let me get outside, I want to take off, I want to fly it real quick, and then we'll turn all of the lights on and see what they look like. It's so bright, yeah it is at the minute. Alright, now have lights on. Okay. Our cockpit lights are actually white right now, and that's not amazing. But yeah. Oh, that was... Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> that was weird. Uh, right, okay, so landing gear up. There we go, at the front. Excellent. We're now going to take off, and we're going to go sideways. And then we're going to fly. Good morning from America, Frantic. Quick question. Have you ever heard of the Oaks They were the OGs along with Machinima in America. Uh, yeah, I've heard of the Oaks Cast. Carrie, thank you. I, I watch some of the Oaks Cast videos, still. Even today. <laughs> I didn't watch one today, but yeah. I still watch some of the Oaks Cast videos. Alright, okay, so nav lights are on. They look okay on the front, oh, on the sides and the back. That looks good. Then we'll add spotlights and cockpit lights. And then we'll make it nighttime. <laughs> that is so bright. That is so bright. Woo! Hell yeah. Uh, put suspension in the rear landing gear to stop the bouncing. Yeah, I guess we could do that. That is incredibly bright. Okay. Let's take it back. We need to change the colors a little bit, obviously. Uh, that was that was far too bright. Um, ooh. Do we want it so we have like a little stopper? I guess you could be right with that. So, I don't know how low a stopper would have to go down to work properly, but let's let's do this. There we go. So, it's a tiny little stopper. Looks inconspicuous enough, I think. Uh, yeah, that works. So, the cockpit lights are actually going to be brown, uh, which might be weird to you guys. Actually, realistically, they should be blue. It's a futuristic aircraft. They should be blue. So, we'll go with, like, this color. There we go, this color, there we go, nice. And then the exterior lights, I want to dull them down a little bit, so we're going to go with this. Swan it in, let's go see what that's like. 
There we go. Nice. The little stopper on the back works. That's good. Let's go. Can't wait to see more videos on the aircraft carrier. Uh, today, I haven't actually got one. I haven't got one for you guys. I might be able to record one later, but we'll see. Are you going to add a hose connector? Maybe. We'll see. Will you add weapons on this plane? Maybe. We'll see. <laughs> it's not put on suspension, but it doesn't need to be. It is fine the way it is, kind of. By the way, hello from Norway. Hi. All right, here we go. Let's lift up a little bit. And then go forwards. Yeah. Nice. Front landing gear up. Let's go ahead and turn on our lights. They're still very bright on the wings, but I'm okay with that, I think. Because we can actually see forwards, which is excellent. And then we can go. When do you stream? Try to add some fuel near the cockpit to balance weight. I guess we could do that. Uh, by the way, hello from the Netherlands. Hi. How you doing? All uh, right. Okay. Let's do this. All right. Those spotlights are very bright. The spotlights are extremely bright. But we need them. That's the annoying thing. You're from Poland. Nice. Cool. You're from Turkey. Nice. You have a double monitor set up? Uh, at my girlfriend's house. Yes. Which is where I am. At home, I've got three. But one's an ultra wide. So. It's kind of like having four. <laughs> I do miss having, having at least three. But yeah. Um... IRL, you would not fly with spotlights on. No, but when it came to, like, I don't know, rescuing someone or whatever, if we turned the spotlights on, we'd blind them. You know? But I guess if we changed the color of our aircraft, maybe that'd be better. You're from Denmark? Nice. What if you make the spotlights a darker white? We already have. This is the problem. They're already, they're already this color. Maybe this color will work. Maybe. <laughs> Uh, but there we go. Right, okay. So, let's say the whole entire aircraft is a slightly different... What if it's this color? You guys are going to hate this. Oh. Oh. Da -da 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 Wouldn't need x-rays when rescuing with those spotlights. <laughs> Just see right through everybody. Oh, that's weird. Oh, wait. Hang on. 73, 70, 65. 73. 70. 65. Oh, didn't mean to do that. It's very dark. I'm not sure I want it to be dark, though. I want, a, I want a bright one. I, I want a, a bright one. Maybe we'll go with something like this. We'll add decals to it so we can add stuff to the outside. And I think that'll be cool. I think. I think that'll be cool. Um, doo -doo -doo. What were we saying yesterday? That the nose should be the same color all the way around. Let's go with red again. Right, we're going to do it. Let's do some paint. Here we go. So red on the nose. All the way around the nose. It's like Rudolph at the moment. There we go, all the way around. Even the bottom? Question mark? I don't know. Right, here we go. I think the, the pattern that we had yesterday was actually really good. But I'm not sure how I felt about it afterwards. Also, I'm actually going to change this to, to white again. And then we can add more of this. So, we can go backwards, but also go upwards with it. There we go. Then use this to go to there. Kind of cool. I think I like that, actually. Um, da -da 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 -da. Meow? Why are you meowing? 155, 148, 140. Looks like it'll be better. Is it also grey? Because they're all very close together. Do, 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 do. 148. And then what? And then 140. It's also grey. That's more of an interesting colour. I do like that more, but I don't know if I uh, if I want to keep that. I want to go with... Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. 
Maybe we'll do like a different kind of orange to this orange. Because I think that makes it look more search and rescue y. E -e. You know? I think it does. So we might actually go with this orange. And I think that'll actually look really cool, maybe. Uh, right, okay. All the way to there. And then all the way to here. Good. Okay, that looks strange. It looks strange. Kind of like it, though. Ba -ba 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 well, white also looks nice. Give it a stripe in the back. Hmm. How long did it take you to build it? Uh, I'm not actually sure. It's like three streams. Well, it's two streams to this point. And then this is the third stream. So I would imagine not actually that long, to be honest. All right, let's do a stripe all the way backwards to there. Okay, fine. And then on the top, we're actually going to break out in orange again right here. Oh, that's going to have to be orange. Interesting. Okay. And then orange back from there. That looks a little bit weird. This bit right here looks a little bit strange. But if we actually start using paint blocks for once, I can actually make something look really cool. Uh, with this orange, I think that'd be awesome. I don't actually think that looks that bad. Then maybe this too. All the way back to there. There we go. Awesome. And then we need to figure out what to do with this little area right here. I actually kind of like the idea of lifting it up so it fits directly under there. That'd be cool. And if we do it from here, that might be nice. Yeah, we'll go with that. And then... Oh, I don't know. Does this go all the way around the back? A stripe literally all the way around? I guess. You guys know I'm just going to change that, you know? Uh, where can you spawn it? Wait, what? Why do you have the ducted fans? Just for show. They don't do anything. They're just for show. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Actually, let's paint this bit this color. Here we go. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Hang on. Eh. We're going to do this over the top right there. And it's going to come down to there. Okay, that's fine. There we go. We're then going to do these pieces the same color as it. There we go. Very nice. And then this bit, I think, will be orange. Yeah. Okay. Okay, looking kind of interesting. Looking kind of interesting. Um... What are the fans really supposed to do in the game? They actually provide thrust. Well, not provide thrust, but you can put power into them and then they can thrust you forwards. If you wanted that. If you wanted that. Okay, we're going to do that there. I'm going to paint this little bit in as well. And we're going to paint this little bit right here. And that little bit right there. Okay. Don't know how I'm feeling about this so far, so let me know in the comments, uh, or let me know in the chat what you guys think. What are you guys thinking of uh, of this this current current paint job? Da -da 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 Can you make it into a jet only type VTOL? It doesn't really work with the uh, the thing that we've got, the microcontroller. Alright, let's run it into what it looks like from, from the side. Okay, we need to do something with this area down here that probably involves orange. Use paint blocks? Yeah, we might have to somewhere along the line. I'm not sure where though and what kind of kind of paint we want to use. But we're also going to do this down here. Which attaches all of that together. Then we're going to go down to there. We're going to actually paint all of this this color. There we go. Then we're going to send it backwards from there. And this should look cool. Woo! There we go. All the way down to there. Interesting. 
That's very interesting, because then this side is different to this side. Weird. Anyway, attach that onto there, this colour. We'll actually paint all of this top bit this colour as well. Paint all of the inside of there. And all of this. Whoop! There we go. And the side of that? Sure. It's all going to be just grey on the top. I think that's fine. Probably. <laughs> I think that's fine. Probably. Alright, there we go. And then presumably this should actually be the same colour as that. But maybe they can actually... Oh, should we just do all of this grey? No more white on these two bits. I think that'll be fine. There we go. Yeah, sure. Uh, we still need to do something down here as well, though. So I'm actually thinking orange along the bottom. Orange along there. Orange along these pieces. And then orange to there. There we go. A little bit of grey. On the underside of this. Here we go. And then orange there. Okay. Okay. I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not sure. Uh, add a bottom fluid cannon for firefighting. But we then we would need to add uh, water. An actual water tank. Which I really don't want to do. Because a water tank is a lot more weight than we than we want. Right? Let's swan this in see what it looks like. Kind of interesting. I think it looks alright. I'm not very good with colour schemes, am I? Not very good with color schemes. What does it look like if it is actually frantic red instead of the orange? That looks kind of interesting too, to be fair. It's quite nice. Uh, right, we're going to make this a different color. On both sides, there we go. I'm going to do it here also, because we should. And there, and then we're actually going to paint this, this color too. There we go. And then I think the whole inside of this should actually be a different color also. So... What do we want it to be? Probably like a dark grey. Drag it. Drag it. Okay. Has that done it into there? Okay, hang on. We need to make sure it looks good. So... All the way along the side. All the way up there. There we go. Touch it together. We can drag this piece in. So I'm thinking we drag this in dark on the inside of here instead of being white. And I think that'll be fine. It can carry containers, right? Yes. Indeed, it could carry containers. Oh, that's difficult to get to, that area. Oh. Oh, there we go. All of that's painted. Yeah, because it was like, if we leave this white, then it's all far too white, because everything's white. But uh, let's do this. There we go. Paint that in. We'll paint all of this in. Paint that a little bit right there. And all of this too. There we go. Okay. And then we need to go behind these. And... Oh, wait. I can't see. We need to paint that bit as well. But it's kind of impossible. <laughs> kind of impossible. Has that worked yet? Has that worked? No. Did it, did it work? I can't seem to paint this bit. It's so annoying. Alright, whatever. It's fine. Uh, I don't think it matters all that much. Alright, here we go. Paint this a little bit too. There we go. And that'll be fine. So, swan it in. Let's see what that looks like. You can't even tell it's a different colour. Not really. Frantic. Yes, what's up? Add a water cannon. I told you, Zane! Um, make multiple detachable compartments to make a multi-use passenger firefighting uh, capabilities or a tanker. Yeah, Steve, that's that's what we're going to do. Um, do, 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 do. Add a drop pod for passengers. Sounds like a perfect idea. I do like the idea of um, having like a, yeah, I, I guess exactly what you said. A drop pod for passengers so we can... Build a little container that the passengers can go, go into. And then... Oh, that looks weird, doesn't it? And then we can drop them all out. And it can parachute. I think that would be really cool, actually. Yeah. Um, I think we need more paint, though. Because this is looking very not painted. <laughs> very much not painted. So... How do I go about painting the front of the wing? I can't... I can't paint the front of the wing. That's annoying. 
All right, there we go. Do this bit. Do that bit. There we go. Okay. Might have to delete the wings to actually paint those. That's really annoying. Uh, grab this. Delete it. Okay. Get it in this color. Put it back in. There we go. Oh, no. Not like that. Like this. And like this. And then paint it white. Okay. Yeah. All right. That's good. So we fixed it. You think it needs more speed? I don't know what speed it actually goes at the moment in terms of miles an hour, but I would assume quite quickly. Yeet the NPCs. Yeah, well, we could drop it out and we could obviously parachute them down. Not yeeting them, but, you know, parachute them down safely. But, yeah, that would be cool. Uh, I don't know how I want to go about painting these guys. I think I want to do this. So we'll paint it like this around the bottom. Including the back and then this around here. Excelente. And then the same thing right here also. And then actually probably the front of the wing as well. There we go. And then probably the front of these wings too. Actually probably all the exterior of these wings. There we go. Excellent. These guys. These guys. And those. And the top. There we go. Nice. These are actually going to be white though. There we go. That makes sense. All right, good. And then we can have decals on the side of these. That'd be pretty awesome. Uh, we could have some red somewhere around this. And I think that'd be pretty cool too. There we go. I really wish I was like more artistic in, in this sense, but I'm, I'm just not, you know? Right, let's do that there. Let's put all of these in here as well. There we go. All the way up to the tippity top and all of these too. Yes. Nice. Boop. And boop. There we go. All right. That looks kind of interesting. I like it. Rope anchors hard points. We do have rope anchors uh, dotted around like all over the place. Uh, what if you make an attachable cannon like a container cannon? Yeah, no. Well, uh, we were going to do that for the water. I'm not sure about... I'm not sure about actual guns. I don't know. Can you take it for a flight real quick? I haven't seen it in action yet. Sure, we'll fly it. Oh, I don't know about the the, the way it looks. <laughs> I like uh, plane vehicles more than ones that just look like they've got stuff slapped all over them. I think it looks okay, but not amazing. Hey! Hi, Paul. How you doing? Oh, that is so bright. They are so bright. A turret container? Yeah, I mean, it's possible, I suppose. Um, what? Wait, what can I use to anchor my helicopter to my ship to reattach it to? Uh, I guess hard points or connectors. They're uh, just like normal connectors? Maybe? I don't know. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Is it waterproof? No, it's not. Oh, you probably want to see it. Hang on. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, make a container for fire fighting for combat and passengers. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Bombing container. I don't know about that. Crash it? Why do you want me to crash it? I'm creator now on the DC server. Wait, on the DC server? Of Stormworks? The DC. Oh, the Discord server. Nice. Nice. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That works amazing and it looks great. Yeah, it actually, it is pretty good. It, it does work quite well. Land it in water. No, <laughs> it's not waterproof. We're currently going like a hundred meters per second too. So if anyone can work that out, that'd be great. Into miles an hour or something. Pick up a container. Do 
do do do do do do do do do do do do do do do do do Try anyway? Why? We'll just die. It'll just sink. The, what'll happen if we landed this thing in water is the back end will float because that's waterproof. This little room right here. And then the front isn't, so the front will sink, and then we'll just die, you know? 225 miles an hour. That's pretty quick. I'd say that's all right, you know? Land in a volcano. All right, here we go. Let's turn sideways. And let's land on this, and hopefully, it'll be good. We'll take this one. <laughs> it's annoying because the camera angle is actually very far. Oh, the, the camera is actually uh, from the front, if that makes sense. Which is very annoying, but there you go. Right, okay, so we then run backwards and we turn on the container. We lift ourselves up a little bit. Okay, we press this to lower our connectors down. Alright, and then we want to go backwards, obviously. Here we go. Oh, oh. Yeah, the camera is like point of view. I don't know how to explain it, but the camera is too far forward. Whoa! Too far forward. It's around the seat rather than... Okay. It's around the seat rather than anything else. So it's hard to judge where we actually are, if that makes any sense. But there's not much I can do in that situation. Okay, so let's say we only had one container. Right? We've grabbed it like this. The camera pivots around the seat. Yeah, it's a little bit annoying, isn't it? In this situation, anyway. Then we do this. To pull it into our aircraft a little bit more. And then we should be able to fly like this. Your chat is at wrong spot, I think. I feel like you might have moved. My chat's the newest chat. Uh, I'm ranked as a creator now on the Stormworks Discord server. Nice. Very nice. Wow, that thing looks amazing. I'm not sure it does. <laughs> it works. I don't think it looks amazing. I feel like the color scheme is all wrong. I'm not very good at adding like detail to things like this. Ram it into a mountain? I don't want to! Why do you want me to ram it into a mountain? Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh! You might be getting your wish. Uh oh! Uh oh! I need to go now, bye. See you, buddy. There we go. Landed. Yes. You've played Stormworks for 700 hours and you've never made anything in the workbench. 700 hours and you've never made anything. Not even, like, anything little. 700 hours. Wow. Uh, right, guys, I don't like it. Uh, I mean, I don't like the the colors. Oh, that actually looks kind of interesting with that. Oh. Oh. It's a panda VTOL. Yeah. Spawn it in. What does that look like? 
I don't know about these lines that I've just added, but I think the rest of it looks kind of interesting. I don't know. The connectors are too far apart and they go crazy just because it feels like it. Yeah, I think they're actually to the side one. Um, realistically, they should be here, I believe. Actually, is that true? Ten. Eleven. Yeah, they should be there instead of there. You are correct. You are, you are correct. So you could do that. There we go. And then this one needs to be the same. So we need to do the same thing. There we go. Connector. And we'll put that right there. Bam. All right, cool. Uh, we need to then connect all of those to this button because reasons. So that's there. To there. To here. And also to here. Very good. Okay, nice. Is there any room externally for emergency equipment? It'll save and where you have to detail. In terms of, in terms of what kind of, what kind of stuffs? Da 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 do 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 do. Uh, does blocks break when they hold something very heavy? Do blocks break when they hold something very heavy? I don't think so. You can paint eyes on the nose like an A10. I mean, I guess we could. I don't know if I want that. I don't know what I want. Like, I don't actually really know what I want it to look like. I'm thinking this bit right here should actually continue around here. Maybe all the way back to there. Because I think that, that fits. That somewhat works. Also, this is actually black rather than grey. So now I've made it all black rather than grey, but I don't think it should be. Yeah, okay. Googly eyes. Your dog says hello? Hi. Hi, dog. Uh, right, let's grab this. What if we painted the nose section on the top this colour? I think that looks a little bit better. But what if we take it all the way around and do this? I don't know. I don't know. Are you going to play the new Warp Under update? Uh, I haven't actually got any countries to the right level to really use it. So probably not. I'm not sure though. When do you stream? Now. I'm I'm streaming now. I'm streaming now. Uh, right, okay. We can add some equipment to the back, I suppose. Also, rope anchors and stuff like that could be added to the edges. Uh, to make the sides look a little bit nicer, I suppose. So we could do something like this. There we go. Same with the rear end. We could delete this. And have... One of those. And... One of those. And then we'll paint it, obviously. So this. There we go. Excellent. There we go. That's good. And then... More stuff. We need more stuff added. Also, the rear end is all just white right now, and I'm not sure what we do about that. Whether we bring this back to, like, here, and then we can send it upwards. And maybe downwards also? I guess. I think that works. Sure. Uh, right, okay, let's go ahead and paint all of this. There we go. I'm not sure what I want to do with this anymore. I'm not gonna lie. Draw a flag. Yeah, I guess we could. Please use it. Uh, hi, Frantic. Hi, how you doing? How you doing? Please don't spam. Uh, pst, Frantic. Yeah, what's up? I'm getting properly stressed out. I don't know why. Uh, remember to check the news on the new DLC and the big update. When's that? Tomorrow. Wait, what day is it? Oh, yeah, it's Friday tomorrow. Uh, are you drunk? Because you're saying you're streaming now, but I thought this was a video, right? Right? Maybe I'm drunk. I don't know. Uh, right, okay. So, maybe we do actually build a container now, and then we, we go with that instead of, uh, whatever we're, whatever we're doing right now. Because I'm not sure what we're doing right now. Paint that little bit right there. Excellent. Paint that little tiny bit right there, and this little bit right here. Okay. So... We fixed that. Let's go ahead and save it as is. 
Oh, actually, what do you guys think of this? I don't know. Uh, right, cool. Yes. Yes. Sadly, it's not space. I mean, I, I, I'm I, glad that it isn't space. And the reason being is because I don't think a space DLC would be done very well. Yeah. It's quite difficult, you know? He drank too much orange juice? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Uh, right. Okay, so we need to make containers. Let's go ahead and save this as that. There we go. And then new. How big are they? Like 29. So let's go to 28 real quick. 28. Good. By five on each side. There we go. And then. Do, 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 do. Up by 10, which is to there. So then we do this. And we do this. Yes. And we do this. Yes. And then we do this. Yes. Okay, good. They don't actually have to look like this, but you know, that's the size that we've got. Um, bah, 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 bah. So then we delete this on both sides. And that one probably. And this one. And we'd add connectors. Here we go. Whack that in there. And whack it in on this one. There we go. That's that's the kind of connectors we need. Excellent. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Make the container with the frantic logo on it. Yeah, no, we could totally do that. That is something we can do. I don't want it to be able to be connected to on the bottom. So we won't do that. But we will delete all of these and have it all connect together like this. That's fine. Uh, I gotta go. Bye, everyone. See ya. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Do, do, do. Where did you get the inspiration to become a YouTuber? I'm not sure. I just wanted to be one. <laughs> so, so I did. Uh, right, hang on. We need to figure out where the door will actually fit on this in order to actually fit it into our aircraft properly. So let's save this as... Can... Can... Container. Save. Okay. We'll load it up outside and we'll go from there. Da 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 do 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 do. Oh wow, I didn't even think about the, uh, I didn't even think about the, this. <laughs> I didn't think about the gap. I've actually put it in quite a nice place for that. Okay, interesting. Anyway, uh, let's get inside and see if we can actually lift it into the right place. Oh, we'll see where we lift it into and then we'll go from there. There's going to be a big air show near your city? Nice. Awesome. That's cool. I've never really been to a proper air show. I don't think, anyway. Whoa, that's too high. Okay, so, we lower down the system thing. Also, hi, Prof. How are you doing? How you doing? Now, here we go. We're going to go down. Let's move over a little bit. Yes. Go down a little bit more. I might add cameras to be able to see where I actually am because I'm currently not doing very well in terms of positioning myself in the right place. Okay, so we've landed on it. <laughs> there, right, okay. So let's say we've grabbed it there. Excellent. Then we pull it in. Okay. So how many above? Probably only like one. Oh. The door would have to go like... Ah. That's a problem. The door would literally have to be... 
at the top of the container. Add lasers to help? Yeah, I guess that would work. That's a good idea. Imagine you're building a B-52 and forgot to turn symmetry on. Oh, that would suck. <laughs> I'm assuming that's what you've done. Okay, right, good. <laughs> Alright, nice. Um, do, 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 do. You getting like on your side? Oh, that's annoying. I think that container is wrong. Why do you think it's wrong? Copy paste it, you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I guess you could do that. Um, you mean these should be pointing upwards? On the ones in game, they're actually pointing down. As long as the connectors uh, are in the same place as each other, it should be fine. Yeah. Uh, right, okay, so we need to make a, what, a passenger one? I don't know how that's gonna look, to be honest. Yikes. Uh, right, so the door itself would actually have to go at the very top of this. We can maybe get that working, possibly. So, a door would legit be there but go there like that I think oh it actually have to go higher but we'll see if this works all right so let's just save this as as container there we go we'll also whoa no 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 we'll also load this up and we'll do the lasers laser Uh, laser point sensor. No. How do I do it? Laser beacon. Check a workshop container. Uh, if you have those containers recessed, containers would have to clip into each other to connect. No, but that's what the ones in game are like. They're just like that, aren't they? Um, do 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 There is? Wait, what? Okay. Hang on. Need to ban someone. Rarely ever need to ban people, but we're gonna ban. Wow! Uh, see ya. Okay, um... Right. Da, 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 da. The distance sensor. Wait, which one is the one that actually sends out a laser beam? That's a display. This is a sensor. That's a sensor. That's a sensor. But is. Which one's the one that actually sends a thing? The three by one. This one. Yeah, okay. Cool. So we'll actually just have like two. Should we have them there? No. Well, I actually just have... Oh, we can't even have it there either. Ah, it's so annoying. Um... Okay. What we'll do is I'll actually put it in here. Okay. I know it's off to the side, but that's fine. It's just going to point us out where the front is. That makes sense. There we go. So that's going to point out where the front is. And then we'll go to the rear. We'll do the same thing here. And that's going to point out where the back is. Uh, and that'll be good. Okay, excellent. So we need to actually have a button for that to turn on when we need it. Which I guess will actually go right next to these ones. So that's fine. Okay, right. Connect this to the laser. Connect that to that laser. Good. Add cameras. Yeah, I mean, we could, I suppose. La lasers. <laughs> lasers! <laughs> Okay, uh, can we paint this a slightly different color? There we go. Okay, let's go. Love you, vids. Give them a... Uh, see you next stream. See you, buddy. Yeah, lasers! Da-da-da-da-da-da. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Seats, dude! Lol! Wait, what? What do you mean, seats? Oh, I need to paint that.
All right, save this. Okay, right now let's go ahead and spawn in it next to the container again. So container, switch it with this one. This, switch it with the do 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 Spawn it in. Nice. All right, let's go. Are you gonna make an X-wing in a future video? Probably not. That sounds difficult. <laughs> it sounds very difficult. Anything in the past 15 minutes change? Um, probably not. <laughs> oh, we added lasers, didn't we? There we go. That's one of the things. Okay, so realistically, if I open this door and I open this door, we can actually pass through. If we go the other way, we can still pass through. Therefore, we can use this as a place for passengers, I guess. Yes, okay, it works. Sure. Um, ba da 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 Okay, right, so, with that being said then, let's go ahead and go back to this and add some little windows. We're also going to add seats and all that stuff, so, I think the way that we'll do it is actually use these. Although, how many can I have? So, I would only be able to, I would be able to have two on each side. Oh, that's really not good. One on each side. That's not an awful lot of seating, is it? Where can I find this game? Uh, this game's on Steam. Okay, so let's add some seating, shall we? Oh, I've added this to there by accident. Ugh. Ugh. Hang on, block. There we go. Right, so we'll delete this. We'll actually have the seating go sideways. Okay, then we'll have this right here, all the way across the end. There we go. Then we'll add uh, manifolds. For the rear. I know that sounds weird adding manifolds for the rear, but there you go. This is going to go all the way down the back end. And that's fine. And then we're going to do the same thing right here. Keep it going. I'm going to do loads of these. And then when we've done all of that, we can actually add some seats. We can paint some areas and that'll be great, I think. Okay, and then another another line, I guess. So actually just go from there all the way to here. Cut it. I'll copy it. Move it upwards. Paste it in. Merge it. Let's go. Yeah. All right, looks a bit weird, but that's fine. Um. Da -da 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 -da. Tried to land it on your aircraft carrier. My aircraft carrier is too big. No, oh, no, too small. My aircraft carrier is too small for this. Beat. Here we go. I mean, we would be able to land it on it. That is true. However, um, it would look way too big for it. If that makes sense. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, six. Okay. We can have an extra seat or we can block off this area for extra things. So we're going to block off that area right there. We're going to go ahead and put that in, put that in, delete this, this, and this, and this, and this. And we're going to add a fire extinguisher to there on both sides. And we're going to add first aid kits to yeah bam bam excellent nice so this will be dropped um which is nice <laughs> to be dropped which is nice and then that'll be fine we're then gonna delete this right here same with the front end okay we're gonna get a parachute and that will be dropped in just like this and just like this and then where's the center of those
It's 11. There it is. There it is. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Grab another one of those. Put it in. There we go. So we can have parachutes that will actually work when we drop them down. That makes sense. Uh, make a ramp and rails to slide out supplies. But this is just a passenger one. It's just for passengers. Do, 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 do. There we go. Good. And then we'll actually add like a, a shelf kind of thing, I guess, over the top of them. Um, okay. So we'll actually add one there. One there. One there. No. One there. Then one there. One here. Oh, no. Here. And there. Okay, that's fine. And then windows. We're going to add loads of these ones. To the middle to design like shelves, I guess. There we go, that works. Nice. Welcome to Harrison Air Base. <laughs> Hi, Endo. How you doing? Um, da -da -da -da. Add a welding torch? Yeah, I guess we could put a welding in. A welding torch in there. Oh, somewhere. Yeah. Maybe. We also need a way to get up the stairs. Welcome to Harrison Air Base. <laughs> Welcome to here, Jenny Airbeach. All right, here we go. Put that there, and put this here. Oh no, here. There we go. So now we can actually get out. That makes sense. Um, do do do. What have you done while I'm gone? Nothing. All right. So, uh, I could have it automatically pop, I suppose, once it falls. But we're gonna add a button for it for now. Um. So if anyone falls with it, they're going to have to push this button. <laughs> they're going to have to push this button for it to work. Or... Hmm... Um... Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
Uh, please call the aircraft carrier, carrier vessel number 01 Frantic Roasted Fish, abbreviated CVN01F Roasted Fish. Why Roasted Fish? Where am I flying to? What's going on here? Autopilot system? I guess we could. Successful drop? Yeah, I mean it dropped. Wait. This is the wrong airfield? No, it is the right airfield. Isn't it? That was weird. That was very strange. Uh, right, okay, so we can actually just have this be pressed and it also just detaches itself from these and then we're good. Let's save it. And now we'll just go ahead and jump in it and we'll test it out that way. Uh, I mean, we could do it different ways. We could actually do some microcontroller stuff to make it work a little bit better, but we'll see if this works. I'm sure it will. Is just my PC or does your live get pauses? Anyone else? I don't know. Bye, friend. I have to go do homework. See you, buddy. Too far forward, like the laser is telling me I'm too far forward. Now the laser is telling me I'm okay to go down. Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Okay, let's go. Try it with NPCs inside. Lasers, lift it up. Yeah, let's go. Oh, also, I need to make sure that I always lift up the front gear. That's that's an annoying one. Nope, he deleted his whole entire thing. It's going to take another hour. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Mm -mm -mm -mm. So, the nice thing about this container is we can just drop it in the water and it'll be fine. <laughs> is there a way to exit... Is there a way to exit the pod without dropping it? You just come through this door. And then you go out this door. Three, two, one, drop! Woo! Oh. It might actually just disappear because I think that's going to despawn and then we're going to despawn and die or something. I don't know. The, the thing's gone. The VTOL has flown away. It has left us. Never mind. Alright, here we go. Alright, ready? Splash down. Oh, yeah. Alright, now we've got a boat. Is it gonna tip over? It might. It might tip over. <laughs> but I weigh so much that I can make it not tip over if I want it to. That's crazy. I'm such a heavy boy. Alright, here we go. I guess we want it to look nicer than this. Roof hatch and windows. Yeah, we do need windows. That is true. Don't know about a roof hatch. I guess we could. And maybe a bilge. Yeah, I guess. I guess. If we do, definitely want to drop it on land. Or on, in water, I suppose. Uh, and maybe a little bit of weight on the bottom to make sure it does actually stay that way up. That would make sense too. So let's delete all of this. Add some some little weight blocks all the way down the sides. There we go. We're going to delete some little holes in the roof. Uh, just there. Just there. Just there and just there. And we're going to add some lights to it. And that'll be good. Alright, here we go. So light right there. Light right there. Light right there. And light right there. Okay, good. So we got a bunch of lights in here. Let's go ahead and paint the interior seats and stuff. So we'll actually do this. There we go. So all of those seats are going to be that color. All of this front panel is going to be that color too. Do the same thing right here. And right there. 
The ex oh, the, the bit behind, I feel like it should actually be that color. Maybe the whole interior should be this color. And then the floor itself is going to be brown. There we go. And then the roof is also going to be that color. Yeah, very dark. That looks weird. Sure. Nice. That looks interesting. Um, so now when we drop it, it's fine. But now we need the outside to look better too, to be fair. Uh, have you seen the hand pumps? I have seen the hand pumps. However, I've never actually used them. So I guess we could put a hand pump in it. To, to pump out the stuff. Um, the water. The water. Let's try and make the outside look a little bit nicer too. So we'll delete all of that. We'll put one of these in. Kind of like this. There we go. And like this as well. And we'll do that. There we go. Bosh. Okay, it looks a bit weird, but sure, we'll go with it. Uh, windows are actually going to have to be, like, this height. I don't mind the idea of actually adding them in above every seat, just like this. So let's add some little windows above every seat. And hopefully they won't be blocked out. I think they will, though. I think these windows will be blocked out via, or by the helicopter, pretty sure. Well, let's do all of that. There we go. Okay. Kind of, kind of creepy looking. Um, would you allow me to make the microcontroller for the automatic chute opening? Uh, you can if you want to. Pontoons on the side for stability. Yeah, but I don't want it to look, I don't want it to look not like a container in terms of its shape. I think the weight on the bottom should be fine. Uh, maybe. Also, I'm just going to delete this. We're going to go for track. These things, here we go. You get whatever color this is. Put it right there. Straight across the bottom. Okay. Uh, little indents would actually be pretty fun too, but I'm not sure how I feel about that. Because we'd have to make the insides nicer. But we'd have to do something like this. And then like this. And then the little indent would actually just go straight through the middle like that. That looks weird. I'm not sure how I feel about that. <laughs> Alright, well, I mean, it, at the minute, it will be able to hold uh, people as they drop down. So I'm happy with what we've got so far. We're going to delete this down to there also. We're going to put this in the other way around. And actually, we'll have it quite high. So we'll do this. Hey, there we go. Okay, that works. Um, we want it to be this color, I guess. Fantastic. And on the inside, this color also? Question mark. There we go. Nice. Yeah. We need some of these. And some of these. Okay. Uh, player sensors. All right. This is going to go right in the middle. Oh, it can't. It's going to go there. How does this actually work? Radius, 10 meters. Detects all? Yes. As soon as it detects a person, the lights will turn on. And that should be pretty good. There we go. Nice. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Um, I guess it'll need its own little electricity supply and stuff like that, but I guess that's fine. Spawn this in as passenger container. Looks pretty ugly. Okay, let's go. It is quite an ugly thing. I'm not sure how I feel about it, but we'll we'll go with it for now. Replace that with this. Spawn it in. Let's go. Whee! All right, inside the the main the main helicopter. Let's go. Do, 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 do. I'm a bit late. What's going on? Uh, we're actually we're building little containers for drop pods. That's what we're doing at the moment. Make a weapon stash on a wall. I guess we could do something like that. That'd be interesting. All right, so we're gonna attach this into here already. Here we go. So we need to go backwards. There we go, go down. We've connected on, excellent. Let's lift it up. Okay, so lasers off. Connectors raised lower. Now we just fly away. Also, the windows are in like the perfect spot. That's amazing. 
Can it carry novel containers? It can indeed. Hi again. Hi, how you doing? How you doing? Alright, here we go. Is there a way to add skids uh, for surface landing? I guess there would be, yes. Recover an old Spitfire wreck 90 meters underwater. I've not seen... I've not seen that mission before. That's weird. Do I hear a siren? Yeah. I mean, you're likely to always hear a siren in this game, to be honest. Alright, here we go. So let's say we, we want to drop it on an island. Let's go try and actually drop it on, on an island. How about the starter base? Let's do that. We'll see if we can do it. Do 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 do. A Spitfire? Yeah, apparently a Spitfire has been found underwater and we need to go rescue it. I've not seen that mission before. Nice VTOL aircraft. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. Right, let's do this. Let's do this. So we lower ourselves down. That's a weird mission. It is. Yeah. Right, here we go. Level flight. Good. Okay, angle ourselves into a location where we think it might land on the island. I think probably here. Go forwards a little bit. Oh yeah. Okay, it'll land on the island if we drop it like now. So let's turn this off. Let's run backwards. Oh, we need to raise it back up. <laughs> Hang on. Let me in. Close this. Lights turn on automatically. Let's go. Whee! Parachutes have been opened straight away. And we are falling towards the island. Will it work? Who knows? <laughs> My net died. No! Uh, can you make a version with guns? I suppose we could. We could make a version. A, a version? A version with guns. Da, 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 what does it cost? I'm not actually sure. I haven't been paying attention to its its cost at all. Detaching the magnet sounds kind of funny. Yeah, I mean it's a bit uh, aggressive. It's a bit aggressive. <laughs> Whee! Landed. Now we just get out. There we go. Yeah, okay, I guess that works. That's how high we dropped from. That's actually really high. Nice, we did it. <laughs> a diving bell attachment. I guess that could be pretty awesome. Uh, I want to multiplayer with you on Friday, 12 p.m. on stream. That is not going to happen. Um, da, 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 Perfect landing. It actually worked out quite nicely. Uh, so you guys want me to actually add weaponry inside there, even if it's just for rescuing people. I guess it does look more like a militaristic one than a rescue one. Okay, fine. So, rifle. Everybody gets a rifle. Let's go. They all get rifles underneath their seats. Here we go. There's one. Two. Actually, not everybody gets a rifle. That's interesting. Not everybody's going to get one. Frantic, you literally hurt his feels. Wait, what? What about my feels? You know? What, what about my feels? Do, 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 do. Why your channel start at night every stream? I mean, for me, it's not night time. I don't know where you live, but time zones. That's why. Uh, right, let's do this and this. There we go. And this and this. And this and this. There we go. Uh, not for you. Wait, now I'm confused. Where is Frantic? But no, how is Frantic? Exactly. Exactly. Frantic's late. 
That doesn't actually go with the meme, but you know, whatever. Anyway, let's go and do this, this, and this, and this, and this. There we go, and this, and this. I don't know why I'm not mirroring it, but there you go. Everybody gets a little bit of ammunition above their seat. Excellent. Right. Not everybody gets a good... <sighs> I didn't mirror it. I didn't mirror it. Okay, let's, let's do this. Back this way. More ammunition under the seats. Let's go. There. Right. We've slotted it all in. Let's go. Save this. Go. Uh, Pranic, I, Pranic is British. Yeah, I'm from I'm from the UK. Um, do, 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 do. Right. Okay. I guess we're I guess we're good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't really know what else to do with it, to be honest. I'm gonna make this indent a little bit darker. There we go. Oh, nice. Okay, I didn't do that on the other side either, did I? No. Okay. Let me paint that in too. There we go. Oh, nice. Excellent. Uh, don't forget to mirror your building, kids. <laughs> yeah. Boop. Uh, right, okay. So, save. Yes. Go. Um, this one works. So, I guess that's good. Um, the actual thing it's... Oh, don't save it over that. All right, load this. Good. I don't know what to do with the back room in this thing, by the way, guys. We've just got, like, an empty room back here and nothing's in it. Oh, it's not even sealed either. Earlier I was saying it was sealed. It's actually not. Interesting. Uh, make a quick and massive bomb, too. Quick and massive bomb. Bomb. <laughs> Warhead. I reckon it can carry this. When the capsule is deployed, it creates a system of flares to protect. That would be kind of interesting, I suppose. Yeah. I like the idea of that. You can make a med room in the back? Oh, I guess that makes sense. Yeah. Have you been to Germany before? No. Oh? I've not been to Germany. I kind of wouldn't mind going to Germany, but it's not really on my, like, list of places I really want to go. I, w I want to go to, like, Sweden and, uh, and Norway and stuff like that. Probably even Finland, too, to be fair. Mm -mm. You're from Norway? Nice. Nice. Okay. You're from Sweden? <laughs> nice. <laughs> cool. You're from the Netherlands? That's cool. Um, right. Guys. I'm not sure what I want to do with this thing. So I think what we'll do is we'll actually delete... We'll actually delete the uh, the bombs uh, from underneath that we currently have. We'll probably upload it onto the workshop pretty much as is. Uh, and then you guys can mess around with it for yourselves and do whatever you want to do with it. Um, but at this point, I've got to the point where I'm like, yeah, I've built something that I like. I built something that somewhat works. And I don't really like going into much more detail than that. <laughs> if I'm honest, Denmark is nice too. They are doing military training right there. Wait, they're doing military training. They're right frantic, right? Yeah. I think they are. Yeah. Uh, do something in the back. I guess we'll do something in the back before we upload it. But, um, yeah. I'm actually going to end the video here for now. I want to make a uh, video later for the aircraft carrier. So, I've sort of got to finish uh, around now. But, um, thank you guys very much for watching these streams. I appreciate it. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one, maybe. We'll probably end up building something else, though. We'll see. Leaders. Bye, guys. Bye, 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 bye. Bye, 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 bye. Hey, watch this. What? The bomb won't even explode, will it?
to you guys. Bye, 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 bye. Forestry. 